Hey everyone, Robert here, the Furniture Guru. So today I've got my trusty little measuring tape because I'm going to talk to you about measuring your space so you get the right size dining uh, room table for the space that you have. So for example, um, I'm going to sit here and measure this room. So full disclosure, this is actually my mom's dining room. So thanks mom for letting me film here today. And if I take this measuring tape out and measure that, we're looking at just over eight feet. So that's a pretty good width as far as dining room tables are concerned. Now for my mom, we didn't have captain's chairs here, so I don't have to worry about that side, but it is the width that's, that's quite important. So if I measure this particular table, this is 33 and a half inches wide. So as a guideline, um, I suggest to my clients that, you know, take two feet on this side and two feet on that side, add that to the width of your table, and that should give you the minimum dimension as far as what you need uh, for a room width to fit this table. So um, why do I say two feet? Well, I mean, if you look at this here, you have your chair, you wanna be able to pull that out. So if there's only one foot, then you're gonna be able to just pull out that much and you, people are gonna be trying to squeeze in here to try to get in there. So we wanna have nice extra space they can comfortably sit down, scooch forward, and enjoy a nice, comfortable meal. Now, in my mother's case, we had some special requirements. So uh, we see that we've got a sofa table in there with some plants on it. She wanted to easily be able to access that. So, you know, now with the extra space that we have, because we have a narrow table at 33 and a half inches wide, she can easily walk back and forth there, access her plants, open and close the curtains, etc. Now, 33 and a half inches wide actually is pretty narrow as far as tables are concerned. Most are going to be about 36 to 42. So just keep that in mind, uh, you know, when you are measuring your space, um, that uh, that's where you're going to find out there uh, in, in a lot of furniture stores. Um, one thing I wanted to mention was there are a lot of, of you who have open concept. So, you know, you're not having to worry about too many walls. So maybe it's just one wall that you're thinking of uh, where the uh, table is going to be situated. So again, that two foot guideline still applies there. Uh, so just keep that in mind, um, you know, when you're choosing the width of your table. Uh, I know you're probably looking at this gorgeous oak table. I'd like to thank my friends uh, at Standard Furniture here in beautiful Victoria, British Columbia. And uh, if you want to check this one out or some others, please come on down there. They'd love to show you. Now for the next episode, uh, I'm going to talk to you actually about different types of tabletops. So this one being solid oak, but there's many available and the pluses and minuses of all of them. So stay tuned for that. But in the meantime, if you have some questions, I hope you'll leave me a comment below. Or if there's something that you'd like to see on this channel, um, please let me know and you'll probably see it in an upcoming episode. So thanks everybody. And until next time, we'll see you soon.